you need somebody to chase around and shit, but they ain't gonna run too motherfucking far. Holler out, you better race to the jump. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely, I'll take care of it. For real. It's popping over. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, glad to be here again. It was definitely a pleasure. You know, it is. It is. It's always a buffalo fresh out when you come. You know, your voice is everything for Fran. And I know you'll probably get tired of me saying that, but no, I'm really a fan. That's what keeps me inspired, keep me motivated. And so. I love saying whatever you do, whatever you do. Because you've been so diligent, you've been, you always been working, you always been on somebody else's track. It's again, let's, let's go into yours. What you got going on? That's the thing. Just years and years, just working, I guess, when I call for nothing to craft and you know, spending time on everybody else's music. No more sitting on it. Like I said, that's why I've been sharing more. You're going to hear more, you're going to upload the stuff. I actually got stuff on, on, on SoundCloud. You know, just stuff that you can, you know, definitely going to listen to. Yeah. You got to push your own shit, though. Yeah. Like, it's mandatory. You know what I'm saying? Like, you don't push it. Fuck y'all's going to push your shit. I mean, I get it, I get it. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I done learned that, though, doing the podcast and shit. That's special. But, like, definitely, nah, you, oh, you got that. I don't need that. You know what I'm saying? You definitely got to put a lot of time and focus into promoting your own shit. You do. You basically get what you put into. That's what you do. Yeah. Once you establish that and it's safe and consistency, like I said, you know, after a while, you get the stories like, man, I'm getting older. I'm going to just probably like, well, I just keep doing some features, features or mm-hmm. I just sound like, no, it really, you know, I'm here forever at this point. That's how I feel. So I'm yeah. ready to just share it. Like I said, I got the hell of a story. You got to be through mm-hmm. mad shit. I got to be through mad shit. And so just being able to express myself and put that on in the record and even share that with people that actually. You know, want to know me and been hungry and asking and asking. That's the thing. So I got y'all. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm yes. ready. I'm ready. 22, 20, 22. Everybody say that now. Nah, for real, there it is. I'm going to show you. It's yeah. definitely a, you know, so. Yeah. The project coming. Um, okay. It's my motto, too. This is a year. It's, it's easy. If it ain't never been a year, like easy. I said, 21, bad, 21, but it's better. You know, and like, so yeah. this is. And I, I feel that, like, I think 2020, 2022 is going to be the year for all the entrepreneurs to really take off. Because I feel like we got it now. We do. We, we, we're more focused. You know, yeah, we're more focused. We're more involved. We all growing. You know, everybody is showing everybody pretty much love and support. Mm-hmm. So if we can just keep that going, everybody, yeah, everybody should be successful. Like, Instead of being in that crabs in a bucket. Everybody will you know, be successful. To kill that stigma that's hanging over the city, though. Like, I'm mm. just not being from here. That's something I'm always heard of. Crabs, but like, don't nobody support everybody. But I was like, it ain't got to be like this. Like, this can be a hub. This is the capital of Virginia. Yeah. It's a dope ass city. There's so much stuff to offer. So much. So much stuff to offer. So why not just tap into it? Yeah. Like, look at it. Anybody go over the business here? Yeah, you definitely, can. definitely can. I mean, look at look at Richmond. You know what I'm saying? So it's black. It's so black, and I love it. Yeah, yeah. Because you definitely a part of the culture, you know. And you with high definition band. Shout out to high definition band. We gonna get y'all. We gotta go get y'all too. Yeah, but but y'all doing y'all all been doing y'all thing. You know, I've been seeing y'all y'all pops in the summertime. Came to Nothing but the fast. Yes, yes, you know, yes. then y'all, y'all got y'all other nights that y'all. But you know, 63, 35, like, yeah. all you, you know, fans, you know what I'm saying? We could always catch us there once a month. We've been rocking, we just started rocking the trio. We shout out to Colleen. You know, there's a lot of people that, you know, rock the trio. Shout out to Colleen. We catch up. Just certain spots, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. The south side is out. Y'all, yeah, y'all, yeah, 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 definitely. You know, shout out to HD. Make sure y'all keep watching out for that. Power and high definition yeah. band. Just for some live vibes. Yeah. 
And it's not only that, but people can book y'all also. Yes, weddings, cookouts, whatever, festivals, whatever, it don't matter. Okay, all right, we're gonna get y'all um, to perform at, um, at, the, at the, the, the chicken, the chicken cook-off. Oh, I thing. know. Yeah, yeah. we definitely got to compete though, because I make a mean uh, chicken yeah, with Yeah, you know, you know, you know, you know, now listen, Fred, Fred gave me some gumbo one time, y'all. She was Miss, cooking it on Instagram. She was cooking it on Instagram. Because matter of fact, you got to the people who didn't see the first interview with her. She's from Louisiana. Mm -hmm. You're from New Orleans, right? Yeah. So she, she cooked a mean dumbo. That's how I'm going to say it. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, she did. Yeah. Gotta get out the kitchen. That's what's not done. You should have brought us a dish. I know. I got y'all. Yeah. 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 Next time, I did. Gotta get right over you here. Know. Just keep on popping, bro. <laughs> fuck it, we just popping. You know what I'm saying? We're going to fucking speak. That's what the fuck we doing right in this bitch anyway. So we'll keep on popping this shit. Fuck it. Let's go. Now, with you being from New Orleans, and you've been here for a little while, do we get a taste of New Orleans in your music? I feel like you do. No matter how bass heavy the beats is or stuff, it's still a part of, like, I feel like I got that soul, you know what I mean? Yeah. You can hear my head, the pain, all that shit come from just being yeah. a part of that free and that heaven that, I don't want to say it's like a, a darkness, but it, you know what I'm saying? We got a certain kind of pain that comes yeah. with in the music, so, yeah. and I feel like being able to play that way, because we just got a sound, so. You think so? I try to, I try, I try to, I try to figure it out, but I can't. But what I do, the beauty behind it is I can. So you really don't know who from here. And then it be so surprising when you do hear something. Yeah, they be like they from Richmond. The what? I ain't even lie to you, and I can't tell. But it's like yeah, I can't tell. I, I get it. You got all these different. But no, you got all these different ingredients that create this certain flavor, and that's what I feel like we got here. Even though it's somewhat segregated, we gotta figure out how to. Yeah, you got the trap size, what they say. Whatever they got to, you know, the hip hop thing and do stuff, got to great popper. How do we need to cross breed it and allow people to see it all at one time and then be able to identify that? So that's the stuff that, you know, people got platforms and establishments and stuff. We got to get back to that. I remember back then we were doing R&B shows and stuff like that. Yeah, we have open mics nights, but it's really no, you know, shows that give you, like myself, or you have like, the people that's actually, you know, working and stuff, we don't do that anymore, so we don't get back to that. You know, that kind of thing. And because it's so much time. You're on the show now. There's people on the platform that's how this motherfucker works. Yes, and of course, the smoking yeah. section. You know what I'm like, saying? This is, this yeah. is super, super dope. Yeah, and the, the growth and yeah. the, the class, the caliber of what y'all doing, keep it up, set the bar. That's what it's about, for sure. You let me keep it up, man. You can get high and do, do productive yeah. shit. Trying to take it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, for real though, man, like, I like this shit. I like this shit up. I see that shit. I like it though. I like it. You know what I'm saying? 
So when Kyrie do a move and Steph Curry shoot threes, everybody else wants to shoot threes and shit. So goddamn, that's me. My, I did. That mean I'm I'm all fucking lit. Huh? The fuck? Yeah. That's all I'm saying. I see y'all though. I'm watching. I'm like a motherfucking eagle. You don't even see me. Yeah, I'm an eagle fan too. I'm like an eagle, man. I'm just floating over the top of y'all niggas, looking at y'all niggas, trying to goddamn paw a cop. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Y'all ain't podcast, y'all paw a cop. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Figure it, figure the fuck out what the fuck I'm saying, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, get your own name. Pump in your own lane. But if you want to ride in mine, I'm going to tax your ass. Tell you that much. Yeah, like the New York toad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, definitely, man. You know what I'm saying? Oh, what's this bullshit, man? Oh, my girl wrote her brother up over here, man. You know what I'm saying? That's what we do around here in the section, man. You know what I'm saying? And I shout out my nigga who wrote photos, too, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, all oh, this dope ass goddamn video footage and this dope ass YouTube footage and this dope ass pictures and shit. Y'all be seeing motherfucking posts and they goddamn flashing all over the fucking pages and shit. Yeah. But who wrote photos? You know what I'm saying? I did all this shit right now, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, definitely, bro. Definitely, man. You know what I'm saying? Who won't got a goddamn empire that they born, man? You know what I'm saying? They got podcasts, they got photos, they got clothes. Goddamn, he got some other shit going too, man. I can't tell you all this goddamn secrets and shit. You know what I'm saying? Goddamn. You know what I'm saying? But we goddamn, yeah, we working out some shit, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Rich City Kills, we gonna holler at you, man. We got some. We got some products, man, you know what I'm saying? We need to, you know what I'm saying, combine. And yeah, you. 2022. Huh? I got some um, sexy chocolate and shit coming out, too. You know what I'm saying? It's tired, you know. Can't tell y'all everything, but you know, this shit is dropping. So, you know, yeah, definitely. Let's get it. I ain't, ain't gonna be here on Valentine. I might have some samples for Valentine, though, like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know, I have a sample for Valentine. You know I'm trying to get some other shit for Valentine's for the people, though, you know what I'm saying? But I couldn't get it marked up in time, you know what I'm saying? So I'm working on that shit, too. You know what I'm saying? But that shit ain't come all the way through on time yet. So I'm gonna work out some other ideas. And, but, but you know what I'm saying? Some shit got approved though now, you know what I'm saying? So we're gonna work out some shit now. I got some people that we got some shit coming for them. Smoke Sacred like Podcast got some shit coming. I'm trying to tell y'all, man. Y'all better believe in it. Eminem and Mars ain't hard at me yet, but there's some other people, they like that shit. You know what I'm saying? We got some chocolate ideas, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. My name is Fred Sonia, and I'm running with the Smoke Essential Podcast. I'm going to do a song for y'all called Keep It 100. Lately, I've been thinking that you really been made to be honest. Baby, be honest with me. That's all I want. And for the mother of your teeth. That's all you got to be. Oh, if you keep it on running with me, don't tell no lies. That's all you got to be. Are you keeping it a hundred? Are you keeping it a keeping it a hundred with me? I'm doing it to us. No faith in all this. This time, I'm doing it to trust. If we do this right this time, everything you say it sits in the back of my mind. Are you keeping it a hundred? Are you keeping it a keeping it a hundred with me? Fuck! Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, man, you know what I'm saying? Y'all ain't, y'all ain't doing that shit like that, man. I ain't getting back to my conversation before I got down. Cause my know my, my goddamn guy gonna cut half of that shit. 
that's what he do to me and shit. I don't be appreciating that shit either. He be cutting my shit out. He be cutting and chopping my shit out. I'm gonna have to pull up to the side, huh? God damn, bro. My shit is just unrated. Yeah, just that moment of silence for that. My shit is just unrated, man. The fuck? You know what I'm saying? God damn. Bitches in my everyday attire. I might have called a little schoolgirl that one day. Actually, I did. She said something, 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 bitch. She said, your mama, bitch. True story. Getting back to our guests, man, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Smoking Section Podcast, man, you know, so that's what we do. We vibe, we chill out, man. We got down, you know what I'm saying? Like, shit. Y'all seen that shit, goddamn. She just goddamn blew down for y'all, man, you know what I'm saying? Because I know my nigga who's on photos, gonna drop that shit right in there on that motherfucking commercial birthday. We just motherfucking hang out. Yeah, that's what we do. Motherfucker, man. You know what I'm saying? I don't know how you want to put But he gonna cut me out though, but he gonna get you right though. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it is. Damn. Yeah, damn. But yeah, man, it's your turn to talk, man. Like, what you got in store for the people, man? Like, on some real shit, like, I mean, I don't know if you're saying, I don't know, like, what you, what you, are you looking for that? Do you want to be independent? You know what I'm saying? Like, what's your next move? Like, cause I don't just see you just, you know what I'm saying? Hanging around here just singing all the motherfucking time. You know what I'm saying? Cause you'll be needing some of this goddamn tea and this vegan shit that they selling up in this motherfucking fountain of juice. You keep goddamn singing like this all the motherfucking time. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, definitely, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> Just as far as what I have in store, just more music, more shows, and the whole thing, I, I feel like the game changes when we act, me actually dropping the pro project. That's what's going to be waiting in, you know, open up doors. When the project drop? It's going to be in March. I, I, you know, I, I, I got a little panel of people that believe in me, invest in me, and you know, it's going to just follow me, and the team has decided that we're going to be able to win so much. Is he gonna sing some of that shit you just did for us? Shit. You know, so, huh? And like I said, got a dope girl project. I got my project that I produce myself from the iPhone. That's gonna be something new. So I'm gonna try to do that right. But you know, I'm gonna give y'all something new. I'm gonna give you a trauma piece. Put the whole project together. It's super dope. Like I said, the brand new joke that I did, he produced that. So, I got a few songs. I actually sent the DJ a few songs and a couple of records. That um, we did super dope. Like I said, so I'm my, my street for vibe. You know, like I said, I love heavy beats. I love stuff that's melodic and it still gotta have that bop. It feels a certain way. So, you know, that's what that's what I want as far as the music. Um, you know what you talking about? What you got for us? You know what I mean? I know you got something that I know you got something that she ain't performed for us. You know what I'm saying? You know, get us get us right, man. That's what we do over here, man. We are not your motherfucking average podcast, man. Dope. Dope shit. What? I think. Ah. Uh, this will be. I guess for a little spring summertime banger. It's called Top Down. It's for the smokers. People who ride with their band shit. Looking cute. Have blowing in the wind. Riding around with the Top Down. Top Down. Blowing big ass with the Top Down. Big cat with the Top Down. Get this cash and you can't fuck with me. My baby got my back. 
I'm from the city and he never double back. Oh. And he gives me plenty, yeah. and he's out the top bag. Oh. We make it so jazzed. Tell you how, 
it, it, you can relate that jump to sports and shit, you know, the high school shit. Like, when I was in school, you know what I'm saying? You know, it was, you know what I'm saying? Five years ago, anyway, 20 years. <laughs> but, like, no, nah, real shit, though. Like, niggas gonna get scholarships and recruited and shit like that, you know what I'm saying? But right, right now, you know what I'm saying? Like, Anybody who, everybody on the motherfucking team getting full, you know, like, we getting our looks. It's just the whole area, and it's a process, you know what I'm saying? I see it with the artists, too. It's a lot of artists, but it is a lot of artists that have been signed, you know what I'm saying? Just got a chance, you know what I'm saying? Put on a decent label, like, and it's still a process, bro, like, you know? Gotta you, have, have, you gotta have that machine behind you, that, you know, that big machine behind you with the steel. You still gotta just have. You gotta, yeah, you gotta. You know, you, you, you got your people that's performing, making money, they're living, but that's all they're going for. And you don't need a steel. But you can find it in the home. You know, there's just so many ways you can tackle it and make a living. Shit, man, play with that shit a little bit, see what it do, man. You know what I'm saying? I ain't trying to take no shine away from nobody else, you know what I'm saying? You know? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna write her song, I'm gonna get her song right, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna have some for everybody. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> By the time the summertime we start doing doing entertaining motherfuckers, we're gonna entertain niggas, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna help her out. She, she'll get you to do it, you know what I'm saying? On a good day, on a good day, she with the shit. Yeah, I'm with it, yeah. Yeah, it's good. Give me you know? Wow. Fuck that Corona shit. You hear what they say? Oh, yeah. You don't even gotta wear masks no more. What? Shit is out here. This is so, let's talk about that. This is what? That's some bad ass shit. shit. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to really just come from Jesus. Yeah. Just yeah. Oh, you gotta keep getting booster shots. <laughs> you saw there was like three on the news. It was like you get one shot, you, you yeah. already got one shot. Hey, you, bro. You got one shot, you get two. It was like, hey, look, man. <laughs> hey, but what's the next thing I see on, on the news? Marijuana. Helps with the COVID, not getting the COVID. Did y'all see that shit? I saw it. Nobody else seen that? Y'all seen that? Y'all seen that? You seen that, DJ Elon? Marijuana, stop it from COVID. Yeah. Yeah, marijuana. I tell you that all the time. You know what I'm saying? I'm a good, like I'm a weedologist, you know what I'm saying? I'm a weed with shit. Hold on, that's another word. Is that a new word? That's a new word. Weedologist? Weedologist. Is that new? Is that official? It's official now. It's weedologist. Weedologist. I ain't never heard nobody else who's a weedologist either. That's a weedologist. See, man, I'm gonna have to go back to the podcast and get my shit up because I don't think we I am a weedologist. You know what I'm saying? It definitely works for a lot. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, what, COVID-19, 2020, 2020. Like, but motherfuckers say you've been getting vaccinated like two. So, like, yeah, definitely, you know what I'm saying? 
Yeah, this show just yeah. this show just ain't right. They yeah. they've been playing with it. They just put it together, bro. Like, no, nah, I might take it. I ain't saying they gonna get the shot, but I might get it in twenty twenty five or something. They really got them. They really, yeah, they really got that jump right, right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I mean, I ain't had a flu shot in a long time. That's what I'm saying too. Like, no, I smoke weed. I'm a weedologist. Weed helps for everything. Helps for a lot of shit. Weed was the only drug for a long time to them politician motherfuckers paid them people off to make the shit legal. That's why they making the shit legal. Why you think they making the shit legal? Yeah. Why you think they making the shit legal very well? You know what I'm saying? Cause ain't nothing wrong with the shit. Alcohol worse than weed. Weedologists. The fuck? Alcohol kills. God damn. Man, look, bro. All I'm saying, all I'm saying, bro. Like, don't do that to us. My girl smoke weed. She got damn blow like a motherfucker. She don't know if it's motherfucker, bitch, but you know what I'm saying? To you, that's a goddamn, um, twant nymph. Uh, and the twant nymph, yeah. She, she got this smoke weed, she blow like a chimney. Yeah, I mean, she blow weed like a chimney, she blow like a Y'all see her goddamn performing on this. Y'all know the fuck I'm saying on this motherfucker, man. Tits give her ass a half a pill, and it's all about rich. Throw the other half down, and she want another bitch in the club going ham. And you know, I like the trick, give her half a G stack. What? Selling clothes and we doing interviews. And we taking pictures, nigga. 
Fuck y'all talking about? Ain't nobody else doing that shit. What? Hey, nigga, you know that I know you know doing that shit. Real, real, real. The fuck? Shit. That's my saying, too. What? I need to repeat it for you? Real, real. Hey, the nigga, I know that you know. I know you know. Yeah. The fuck? Shout out to Trevor. 